Get your ass over here, Chuck. Yeah, come. Chuck's gonna Happy, do a hunt. Uh, 100th episode. I can't believe people watch the shit, but okay. Neither can I, Brad. You would have, actually, if you put in all the shit that you edit out, you probably have 300 episodes. It's too bad. And we probably all have no gym memberships. Yeah, we, we all have no gym memberships, and most of us would probably be arrested on certain things. And the YouTube channel <laughs> would be banned. It would be taken down. But congratulations, man. That's actually pretty cool. Thank you, I Brad. Guess. I appreciate that. Maybe we'll get Tamika to take her shirt off for the 100th episode. What do you say, Tamika? Hey, wake up. Come, come say happy 100. Um, to the 100th episode, keep going. 100 more to come. These guys are fabulous. They're funny. They're crazy. Keep you motivated. Keep coming to the gym. When you don't feel like coming, come. That's how you get results. All right, so it's the 100th anniversary. 100 episodes. We're here. It's our anniversary. He's still waking up. Yeah, still waking up at 6 o'clock in the morning. 100 episodes. Andrew's done an amazing job. He's a hell of an narrator. He's a great friend of Jason. He's a great photographer. And, uh, you know, 100 more to come. And to all the people out there who need entertainment, you got a great guy behind the camera here. It's a great time in the gym. Go Donald Trump. Don't stop. And fuck Jason. What are you doing? Where you been? Lenny said you've been ducking him for a month, right? Was that last week he said he's been ducking you? That's why he's here. No, he's not ducking you. What he's you got a treat for all you fans. It's going to be a surprise. Oh, boy. A surprise. surprise. It's instead of the ghost hunters, it's the tranny hunters. Back, Mystery toge hunters. back together again. Mystery hunters. Okay, tranny hunters. Mystery hunters, whatever. <laughs> tranny hunters, that's a good one. <laughs> Lenny well, says happy you... Happy Friday, everybody. Uh, I will be at the Coral Sky Amphitheater tonight for Slipknot. I'm gonna oh, get yeah, insane tonight. <laughs> Too bad you can't film that. He's going to that show too. Yeah. Who? 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 Kevin? Yeah, he's going to that show. <laughs> Watch the, out, Kevin. You might get anally raped. The Slipknot. By, by the <laughs> madman. I'm afraid when I hear Slipknot and you sickos, it has something to do with autoerotic as, 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 asphyxiation. <laughs> It'd be like Carradine. They're both going to be hanging with their dick in their hands. What a way to go. One thing that a lot of lifters don't understand about the squat is that the lower you go, the easier it is on your knees. Because when you do a partial squat, your quadriceps have to be in charge of changing direction at the bottom. When you go low in a squat, the glutes, the hamstrings, and the hips help you change direction. And that's when the knee is in the most unstable position. So these guys doing their partial reps are really risking knee damage. But their excuse is they don't want to go low because they want to protect their knees. They're doing everything 100% backwards. And you put the dildo like right down low enough so where when you're going down you can put yeah. yeah. That's your that's your guy, that dildo. Hey. As long as I get my nut. <laughs> that's a very selfish attitude. We're, we're, so, we're glad you're honest. It's okay, you can't hide from us. We know all about that shit. <laughs> How you feeling? I don't feel good today. You don't feel good? No. That went up like nothing. Yeah, but I felt it. When I'm strong, I don't even feel 315. It's too early. I'm used to this time. I know. I gotta wake up. I'm gonna oh, man. Bump up the rest of the golf. It's like those early morning football practices to start off camp in August. It's hot and humid like this in Pennsylvania. I remember that. Everybody's all quiet. And that old school coach, man, you had to run around this track. You got winded, and you started the grass drills, and you did all your shit. Then you started hitting the Oklahoma drills. It was brutal, and this guy didn't—you didn't pass out water. That was the '80s. Very brutal, but you woke up real quick. Remember the look on the kids' face? Everyone was scared, like they were going to war. Nobody talked. Silent, and it was humid up there. Like, tch. I wish I, I'd pay a million dollars to come back there, but knowing what I know now, a bunch of cookie cutters. Those kids wouldn't even last a, a minute. You know, they're out there rushing water to them all the time. Are you all right? Are you all right? They have all these rules. Like, fuck that. Can't hit certain days. 
I they practically don't even hit at all anymore in practice. They're, allowed, they're not allowed to. That's why the NFL quality sucks compared to what he used The to movie be. Pixels that just came out, I'm not sure how Lenny did not get a cameo appearance in Pixels as Donkey Kong. I swear to God, you look more like an ever seen your Get him from behind. He looks like Donkey Kong. I want to show you Listen, I, I'm not getting behind Lenny for anything, well, if you know what I'm saying. Behind looking I'd rather be behind Lenny than him behind me. Uh, well, that's an astute point, actually. I think I would agree <laughs> with that. And I may like it. But anyway, it's eight weeks out, the Ruby Classic. And I have a treat for you viewers. To catalog how lean I'm getting, we're going to go by the glutes. So I'll stand right back here. And you can get this. Oh, no. Just for the viewers, you can see how ripped I'm getting. You can watch week by week, tell about how the glutes are. Ready? <laughs> Check it out. See it? That's as close as I'm getting to your ass cheeks, well, Lenny. I'm keeping a 10-foot buffer zone. We're going to do that every week, as Jason calls it. What does he call that? Sickening striated glutes, I think. And it is week-to-week -week progress. What if he also has a term for that? What does he call that? Uh, it's on the tip of my tongue, but as you can see, week by week. Yeah. Check out the abs too. The Palumbism, eight weeks out. The Tom 310 pounds. Tom Platts of abs. Yes, 310. 310, baby. Oh, you freaks. See the quads too. Bunch of cookie cutters. Fat fucking Lenny, huh? Where's the fat? Where's the fat? Who's like this eight weeks out of 310? This competing in Olympia, by the way. Dennis Wolf, he weighs about 260. Fucking little German punk. What the hell is this? Ah, smelling salts. <laughs> In case you don't have these, these are ammonia caps. Very dangerous. You could get Chuck's piss soaked underwear. It's just as good, probably even stronger. And with one kidney, there's a lot of uric acid in that piss. So, it's a viable substitute. Haven't used these since Andrew Kalora did the 650 bench. But you, honest to God, you know what he did with them? He put two up his nostrils, and I went and squeezed his nostrils together. That's how he got that big lift. How you feeling about this 405, Jay? Just gonna do an easy one. I still don't feel warmed up. I still don't feel strong. So we'll just do another warm up set. Load up 455. There you go. Take what the good Lord gives me today. Yep. And the good Lord's gonna give me Christina next Saturday right here. Oh I know it, I can sense it. And I will be on call. As you guys will be on call too. I'll be sticking right, out here. Give me a lift off on my three, quit talking. Jealous? <laughs> years old. Look at that. Come on, baby. Ready? Count kind of three. One, two, three. You gotta let go of that sooner. You're holding on to it too long. Lenny likes to hold on to things yeah. for a long time, you know. He was grabbing that like yeah. a monster dong. <laughs> Severed bicep <laughs> tendons. Return to the scene of the crime where that tendon snapped. Doing four off. Uh, what exercise were you doing when you so did reverse tennis reverse rows with 405? Actually, I did 26 reps. I had straps on. That was in 2007. It went snap. Walked out of here, pissed. I actually remember that you used to walk around a gym with a huge brace on your arm for months. Yeah, it healed up when the brace came off. My arm was about nothing but bone. This was about seven years ago. I yeah, remember that very well. Yep. I was going to come in the southern states at 275. Best shape ever. But there you go. Lenny came to the gym with his arm totally immobilized in a brace, but he would do legs. All oh, you porno addicts would quit because that's your jerking off hand. That's, see, that's more important to you. That's why you're not posting any lifts because you're too busy looking at porn, which is, can be a demotivator if used incorrectly. Just like anything else, you have to use it the right way. <laughs> but I'm going to do it again, risking injury. And if it snaps on film, you know what? Good. If I die, I want to be dead on film. Just imagine that, your death on film. How many people get to say that? You fucking porno addicts. Especially you ISIS, you porno addict, hypocrites. 
I'm calling you out. You think you're so self-righteous. You're the biggest porn freaks there are. Who are you kidding? Stoned and some girl for adultery while well, you're jerking off. I know you are because I'm monitoring your, all your fucking, you know, cell phones is, is fucking ISIS with the porn. Who are you kidding? Fuckers. You got the guts to come here, do you? Go after Pam Geller. Ooh. Fuckers. What the fuck was that? Hmm? What the hell did you just put in your mouth? Nothing. Is that a raw egg? Don't let the viewers see this. Oh, they're seeing it. Actually. Oh, they're seeing it. My joints, the secret. I hate to give it out. Eggshell membrane. What? Eggshell membrane. What the hell is it's that? Priceless. It's the best joint repair substance known to man. Eggshell is it's that? Also got a little bit of protein. So you just ate a raw egg, right. and you're no, eating. No, and you're yeah, eating. The shell, the eggshell man. One, two, three. Two more, play that. Alright. Good pump set, work set. Yeah. Just a little bodybuilding, not too strong today. I nice said a ten. Any Olympic competitors doing that? Huh? None of you. None of you. Oh, oh, oh. I like you? To, I'd like to see Jay Cutler post a bench press video. It's a fan. I see you cooking cutters eat a raw, you don't have the guts to eat a raw egg. You eat some raw ecstasy or something like that. But you won't eat a fucking raw egg, which is good for you. Bunch of point. And you, I wouldn't invite you fuckers to do it either because you'll get salmonella. You know why you got a weak fucking immune system. I can eat fucking shit and not get sick. How's that? I can eat hepatitis laced fecal matter and I'm not gonna get sick. Jay, how about you? No matter, I'm not into poop play. I enjoy a lot of fetishes, but I have my hard limits. No poop, no children, no animals. Leonard. How about a, a baby chicken shit in your face? That'd be the ultimate fetish, of course, to you misfit maniacs, right? I'd like to see Lenny fuck a chicken. <laughs> The chicken just left, Brad, so we'll wait till Monday. Or Chuck, Brad or Chuck. How about some white trash chickens? That's very tasty too, the texture. If you got enough balls, you got an immune system, go ahead and eat the fucking raw egg. Trust me, your joints will thank you for it. Because my, my tendons should be snapping, but they're not. So you just got the secret. Rich Piano. All the Delray Misfit animals are converging right now outside the gym on this rainy day. Enter one, enter, enter two, enter three. Gentlemen, welcome. Just in time. Just, hey, Jay, what's up? How I'm you doing? I'm so happy to see Jason here. I'm really in a good mood. Hey, Jason, I heard a rumor that somebody might be competing against you at the Ruby Classic in September. You know who it might be? Who? Dun, 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 dun. This one. Oh! Uh-huh. Nice. Now you might have Gideon and Jennifer to contend with at the Ruby Classic. Jennifer! What? What it is. How you doing? Good. I was telling Jason that you might be competing at the Ruby Classic in September. That is true. Where does that stand? We'll let you know. Keep well, it under wraps. It's definitely September, October for sure. For September. sure. Doing it. It's pissed. What? It's pissed. Who's pissed? <laughs> what? It's pissed. Jennifer's it's been pissed. out of Jennifer's been out of this gym for so long. 
and she hasn't <laughs> participated in our shit show for so long, she forgot what it's piss means. <laughs> it's piss, pissing, piss. Great. This evades your memory? I, well, pissing. Or did you just intentionally block it out? Pretty much. I tried to forget it all. Yeah, I had to move across the street. Move across the street to get away. To Planet Fitness. I don't think it worked out too well for you. No. No, not when I have to Come on! Out, Jason. It's piss. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna have to cut your carbs. You're only eight weeks out. Yeah. I hope you're not eating carbs. I'm not eating carbs. Look at his veins. You tell him about the uh, look. See, look at that arm. Holy shit. Look at those fucking arms. <laughs> We're gonna set up the bench, and he's gonna touch his ass to it, and he's gonna squat it back up. Good luck. I witnessed it. The challenge has been set. You and Charlie, 400 pounds of rocks. That's not quite parallel, but it's it's low. I'm scared to look back, <laughs> bro. Is that Dude, Debbie over there? The Misfit Debbie DeAndrea is in the house. Debbie ought to come back and see how they make a, an amend. Well, I already had a chat with Debbie off camera, and she has politely declined to appear on camera. Oh, wow. Whoa! Look at that! <laughs> God oh, damn! <laughs> Hulkin! I don't think there's many competitors. There's weight class. They see this, they might, they're not even going to show. Now, up. what is light heavy? 189. <laughs> What's what, light heavy weight? What do you need? To one, one, 176 to 198 and a half. Okay, that might be a bit big for you. What do you weigh? I don't know. I haven't weighed myself in weeks. That's good. I'm just going how I look. Going how I look in the mirror. Look at that. <laughs> so if you could get under 176, you'd be a middleweight. I don't think it's going to happen. You'd have to go on ketosis diet, no carbs, immediately. Yep. I don't know if you have what it takes to stick to a ketosis diet. No, I would hate it. I would be in misery. I don't know if Jason has what it takes to stick to any diet. Unless it's fast, fast the food. Himalayan. The Himalayan diet. <laughs> What's that? Cans of Coca-Cola. <laughs> <laughs> Cans of Coca-Cola. <laughs> Those guys that climb Mount Everest, you ever see how much Coca-Cola they drink just for the high calories? Those base camps where they where they stay are littered with Coca-Cola. Jesus, Lenny can't Tight bend hamstrings. down without kicking out one leg like a girl. Tight hamstring. <laughs> like a girl. Tight hamstring. When Lenny bends over, he actually does a curtsy. <laughs> Whoa. No, we need to see the thighs. That's your best body part. Peel those pants down. <laughs> Should I? Yeah. <laughs> Jason, when have you ever had an issue removing your clothes in here? No, not all the way. You have underwear on, right? Yeah, I have. Okay, jeez, thank God. No, no take a pants on. <laughs> look at those thighs. No, those look good. If you could get down to 176, you would have the biggest legs in the middle way. Yeah. Look at that, Lenny. Triceps are unreal. Uh, you're just way behind on the diet, bro. Eight weeks out? I get some leanness. <laughs> Jason said I got some leanness right as he was pinching his love handles. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> Jason's got a surprise. He's going to whip himself into shape. You need a body waxing. Can we film that? <laughs> I would love to see Jason here. <laughs> what an animal. <laughs> what an animal. Better than uh, Phil Heath's poor fest routine. Because you gotta make noises like that. That's what the crowd wants. <laughs> oh. Traps are like gonna hit the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking freak show today. Debbie's looking good over there. Debbie, I, I had a little chat with Debbie, like I said, and she politely declined to appear on camera. 
Debbie's looking pretty big. Yeah, have you she's... talked to Jen yet today? Yes, I have. She's looking fine. Jennifer is looking great. Jennifer might be competing in the same show as Jason, as a matter of fact, and Lenny. She might be in the Ruby Classic. Depends on her conditioning. I heard the bodybuilders used to eat fish and freaking water. Green vegetables. Oh, yeah. Back in the, they were ripped in the 70s. Oh, were they like seven or eight? Yeah, I think you go low carb. I don't think you're going to lose size on it. No. I think Kevin Lavroni was a big fan of the 14-day salmon diet to get into condition fast. He would do water and salmon exclusively for 14 days. That makes sense. And whammo, you're in condition. Hmm. Jason, didn't get that canned salmon. Just fish out the little bones in there. That's yeah, the best can, kind. canned salmon. The cheap you can't salmon. use a white fish because you need the fats. Yeah. It has to be a fatty fish. But you, he, he, he needs to do a 14-day salmon diet. He's yeah. way behind. 14-day salmon diet. I'll do it if you feel I need it in a few weeks. You know, I'll pull out all stuff. You gotta come in ripped. Just like Debbie said, you gotta come in ripped. I remember watching one of your earlier Misfit videos. She Too said many that. of today's bodybuilders are not willing to feel the pain. They want to use drugs to use shortcuts. And they get a soft look. Cedric McMillan. Who said? Who's Cedric I McMillan? I pro that can't seem to get in shape. He's a pile of crap. You gotta be a real. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be a real stud to do a 14-day salmon diet. And there he is, right there. I'm doing it. I'm doing the 14-day salmon. I'm buying a bunch You're of salmon. Have salmon come out of your rectum. I'm gonna eat salmon day and night for 14 days. Well, if you take in. <laughs> 50 grams of salmon protein six times a day. That's 300 grams. That's pretty good for his body weight. A pound and a half for pound of lean muscle. All I gotta do is eat the cans. Eat the damn cans of salmon. Eat the damn cans of salmon. The only problem with the canned salmon is gonna be your sodium. But if you back off the canned salmon soon enough, yeah. you can get the water out of you. The, yeah. the sodium in your breath. You probably do have sodium free salmon at certain stores. Yeah, so I've seen it I know before. where they have it, Aldi's. Yeah. <laughs> My favorite store, like the Communist Food Distribution Center in Cuba. No advertising at all. Very depressing place, Aldi's, but hey. Aldi's is all good, baby. <laughs> yeah.